Hello, everyone, and welcome once again to Final Fantasy Tactics Advance. Con Migo Devin. This will be part 31, and in this episode, we will be progressing the storyline. We've been doing a lot of missions lately, so now it's about time that we went off and progressed the storyline. I'm sure you guys are really enthralled by it. It actually is... It's a great storyline. I love it. I was telling some friends about it, and they're like, oh, it's just a game. I'm like, well, this is the storyline so far. And they're like, oh, wow. Like, I didn't realize it was kind of that deep, but it's it's pretty it's pretty nice, and it only gets better from here. A spirit or ghost was seen going into Nargai Cave, and it's making low, moaning noises. We can't sleep. Please investigate. Well, heaven forbid people use sleep. I'll just use my black mage, or my blue mage, and cast night. That should work, right? Right? Yeah, 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 it'll work. Why not? So we will accept these conditions, and... Let's go see what's going on in that cave. Excuse me. Now, I actually want a certain law. I want to make it a little bit easier, because I really don't like this, uh... No, 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 don't go say hi to him. And they better not start camping in it. Okay, good. Oh boy, we're gonna have to do some work after this. How far is fire? Okay, not that far. Actually, let's just go to the card keeper. Yes, I could. Says card cheap. Now that Marvel season's over, the neighbors are driving up target area prices. Okay. Let's see if there's a fire in here. No, you don't want to help me out. Fine, that's cool. It's cool. What I was mad. And we're almost there. Great. We're gonna have to do a lot of work after this. I'll actually do those off camera. It's it's basically just you defend, and I'm not sure if you guys have seen it. Uh, yeah, you've seen it. It's just it's always the same battle. Pale Company. Whenever Marsh is done like this, we get a kind of a feeling. Funny. Here I am looking at a ghost. But I don't feel scared at all. That's because you're not a pansy, Marsh. It's going further inside. Whoa. Oh, well, didn't see that coming. Exclamation point. Now what's going on here? Where'd the ghost go? Oh, there he is. That's, that's our little buddy. What's up? Where's he going? He's so cute. Aw, where are you going? Um. Okay. This isn't the first... Okay, he's dancing. This is bad. And don't eat our friend. Are you serious, man? A totem, huh? It, it absorbed the ghost. Intruder. No one but my master may approach the world thread. Your master? I guess they do serve a master. I came to destroy that crystal. Or world thread, or whatever you call it. I'm not leaving until I do. Well, <laughs> he's not going down without a fight, obviously. Ooh, okay, yeah. I am the Totima Amadramalik. A dramalik. I actually got it right. By my strength, I shall defend the world thread and destroy all those who seek to harm it. Well, alright. To each their own. Let's check out the levels on these guys. 13, 13, 13, and 15. So we're actually pretty good, so we should be fine. Now, Marsh, don't die in, like, the first five seconds of this battle, or else I will be severely upset with you. 
course we're gonna have our Dragoon in here, Lana. Let's get our Blue Mage into some of the action. And we don't really need our, let's get Mont Blanc in here too. He needs some screen time, he's been kind of down. And let's not use fire. So all we have to do is defeat the boss. We can actually just dodge the the drakes in the front, but um, rather not. I kind of want to grind off of them. But we'll see what we can do. Hopefully, I'm not in over my head. Open up with our famous Beso Toxico move. Um, why? Oh no. Oh no. I forgot to re-equip him after he went to prison. <laughs> Alright, let's do this barehandedly. There always has to be something, isn't there? And I can't. <laughs> silly, silly me. Well, we'll do what we can. When someone's sent to prison, all their items are unequipped. Unequipped. Tid. And we level up straight off the get-go, and I love that little fanfare, and we do a little jig. Um, yeah, um, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, fire is against the law, and I must ask you to um, cease and desist from your little thing. There you go. He probably missed on purpose because he's scared. Scared of Mont Blanc and his, his mad bolt bolt powers. I'm going to try to take out these other dragons first. I actually might should focus down Amadre uh, and arm... I have to see it again. Let's actually check him out real quick. Adramalik. He has an attack of 329, a defense of 289, magic power equally just as devastating, move of 3, jump of 2, evade of 30. His abilities include light speed, lightning fast, which nullifies there are ability. Scorching Flame deals damage in a straight, straight line, which we just witnessed. And Howl of Rage, reducing the speed of surrounding units. He also has Soul Sphere, which is uh, a soul-stealing aura that deals damage to our MP, and Weapon Attack Plus. If his Weapon Attack strength wasn't high enough, he, he just wants to overkill. So we're going to get Marsh in here, and we're going to try to deal some good damage here. And I can't use Backdraft, that's fire. So we're going to try to do some 58 damage. Not too shabby. Not the greatest, but not too shabby. Now, if I'm not mistaken, he's immune to Twister. Yeah, he's immune to it, so that's not going to do us any good. He's just about immune to all of these really good spells. Um, Knight, I really don't want to use that because that could spell game over for us actually and I don't feel like having a game over actually not today I mean you can ask me tomorrow I might I might say no I would say no bolt breath oh yeah totally bolt breath an interesting tactic as well if there's a law then you can use a beastmaster on beasts take control of their units Oh, nice. And you can make them break the law and get arrested. So that is perfectly <laughs> a viable strategy. It's an insta-kill and they can't return ever. So it's kind of, it's kind of a good idea. Counter Marsh. Ugh, come on, you can counter better than that. Let's get our non-equipped Dragoon out. And do absolutely... Nothing. I mean, I could use Fire Breath, but I'd rather not because he's going to counter us. So, I could actually move here and use Fire Breath. Not there. Silly Goose, move up here. There we go. And no, 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 I'm not falling for that again. <laughs> you guys are probably all like, no, no, don't do it, don't do it. Yeah, phew, I, I caught it, caught it just in time. I'll see if we can get a critical on this guy. I haven't been really lucky with the double shot criticals. 
I mean, you have two, you have an extra chance to get a critical, and I, I never seem to do. This guy is really powerful, so you want to be make sure that you have some really strong characters with you, whether they be high levels. I should actually use uh, Lenny in this one, but I decided against it for no particular reason. Just because I'm cool. And he's actually down to 68. So two more good attacks should do him in if he doesn't just does devastate and destroy all of my characters right here. With his breaking the law move right here. 108 damage. Come on, Judge. Yeah, yeah, now you're in trouble. Card fine. Take away his cards and his, his equipment. I love how it's... He looks like, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to use fire. Bull shenanigans. I'm calling shenanigans on all of this. And now he's really sad. He's like, I'm, now I'm feeling really sad that I, I used that fire. I'm going to totally ignore those things because they're super powerful. And actually... Let's get him on the combo. So double combo power activate. He just goes in and punches him. <laughs> he doesn't have any, he doesn't have a weapon. And it actually does quite a bit of damage, so I will take it. Good, good job, Utolio. You, you really pulled it through for the team there with your super punch. Couldn't have done it without you. Give us back the ghost. Oh, they're... He ate all the ghosts, and now they're gone away? That ghost must have become part of the crystal's power. Yeah, I knew that. I heard that the crystals were pure magic. But now I think there must be something more. Some kind of incredible energy. You think? That could create the totema in all the different races. Yeah, what is this power that's creating the crystals? Where exactly did they come from? Well, that was kind of uneventful. Nothing really big happened, so let's just go on our way. Oh, boy. Not you again. <laughs> you again. Uh-oh, Babis. The air in here has changed. What have you done? Acting against the prince's wishes again, are you? Uh, no. Ma Mama, where are you? Mama, where? What? What? A seam. It must have been left over. Babis. Prince Mute? Where is everyone? I'm alone. I'm lonely. Where are you, Babis? The prince is looking for me. Or, question mark. Let us say that you are right, and there are two worlds. How much then is this other world worth to you? What do you have there that you do not have here? Money? Power? Something worth causing the prince so much pain for? Well, I... What? Nothing? You would make the prince suffer over... Nothing? I must return. The prince needs me. We'll meet again. And next time, I will not be so forgiving. Where did he, where did he, to, to, to teleport the, I want to teleport. That's what he's sighing about. Added the Banga Battle Command Totema. So, sweet. Bongas can now use it. And Marsh Mastered Farfist and Mont Blanc learned Bolt Shot. Happy days, happy days. Thursday, Wednesday, happy days. And I know exactly where you go. I don't even need to look anything up because I know that what we get here is pretty dang sweet. Oh, and everything's under attack. 
I'm going to do that off screen. But for now... Oh, we never did Lutia mop up. I knew I missed. Oh, and we get a ribbon. Now, what is a ribbon? What's so great about a ribbon? Let's see here. Let's go to start. Let's go to accessories. Um, let's go to accessories. Oh, no, there, it's, it's a helm. Oops, <laughs> I knew that. So it has a defense of two, a resistance of five. Why am I so excited about this? Um, this woman's this woman's ribbons wards off all ailment. Huh, what? Ribbon null all status ailments. So any ailments targeted towards any girl is automatically nullified. So that's something good to know. So I have to decide whether I want it on my assassin, I want it on her or her. Ooh, so many decisions, decisions, not sure, but I'll figure it out. Anyway, so Babis is now really upset with what we're doing here, so... Oops, our bad, not so great, but nevertheless, we'll... we'll we're, we're trying to set things right here, so... I'm not really concerned with Babis, he'll get in the way, but... We're gonna... we're gonna... our resolve is stronger, just we haven't realized it yet. So anyway, this has been part 31 of Final Fantasy Tactics Advance. In part 32, well, in part 31 and a half, I'm going to be running around everywhere, saving the planet, it feels like. And in part 32, we're going to do this mission that I completely forgot. And I'll see you guys then. And a little bit of the story will be in there, so I'm going to put a story kind of landmark on that one. So I hope to see you again. Like if you enjoyed. And I hope you guys have a great one. Bye, guys.